subscribe, like, and comment. Hey, hey, hey. Y'all know y'all want to. You know y'all want to. It's free. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. This is Mystic Waters. And today, we are playing Beyond the Stage. Oh, chapter 14. Eh, 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 eh. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Y'all ready? <laughs> We are ready, yes. And just to let y'all know, this is the second time I'm reading this because I recorded this and it didn't record shit. <laughs> oh, but you know what? I love the story so much that I went ahead and read the whole story up to where I stopped because the story is awesome. And I love you guys, and I know you guys love this story. So we're going to go ahead and get into it. You hear what I'm saying? But you know, I had to do this a second time. So, <sighs> all right. But I, you know what's funny? I didn't record the whole story. I knew something was off. I had to, like, stop and I'm like, really? If you know episode, you know that you can't just restart an episode. You got to restart the whole season, honey, the whole story. Okay? So I had to read... 13 episodes again but it's okay it's okay because i love the story all right all right <laughs> all right this is number 14 let's get to it looks like she went to jail boo boo miss mm -hmm. <laughs> jason your charges have been dropped really you're free to go <laughs> you like my deep voice <laughs> good morning you know i'm you know i'm recording this in the morning you know, thank you good morning how you doing yeah talking to you yeah you right there uh, how, how you doing how you you good you doing good okay you got snacks okay anyway hello aunt jesse where have you been jail what i got caught and they charged me with trespassing but the studio ended up dropping the charges well did you get me my any gossip I don't want your trip to be in vain. What a bitch. <laughs> I'm fine. Thanks for asking. I only spent the last 18 hours in a holding cell. Oh, you poor baby. I tried calling you for my one phone call, but you didn't answer. You should know by now that I don't ca answer calls to my personal phone from... Wait, my personal phone from numbers that I don't recognize. Now answer my question. Yes, I got Mystic on video flubbing her lines, but... Security confiscated my phone and erased it from there and my cloud. Ugh, what good are you? I got arrested doing what you told me to do. It doesn't matter. I'll pay for your ticket back to New York. <laughs> New York. <laughs> New York, but consider yourself fired. But Aunt Jessie. Oh my gosh, she's evil. Oh, and that's her auntie? Uh-uh. I wouldn't have did it a second time for her. She's not appreciative at all. Beyond the Stirs, season one, episode 14, back to reality. Back, 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 back to reality. Back to, back, back, back to reality. Sorry. <laughs> Coffee does wonders. Oh, Stefan, you getting your oil, B? Go. Ah, Nancy Stefan, y'all know oh. she's my favorite. I, I can't with Nancy. I can't. She the realest, y'all. <laughs> Did you forget who I am? You might get things by me. Hold on. Ooh. You might get things by me for a while, but I always find out. I know all about your little meetings with Jesse J. Nancy, please. Shut up. Do you know how much money you cost to label by leaking now or never? All for what? A quick buck? I'm sorry. I don't want to hear it. You selfish bastard. You're hoarding all of this money while the mother of your child is struggling to pay her medical bills. What? Yes, I did my research, and I know all about Chrisette and her battle with ovarian cancer. At first, I gave you the benefit of the doubt. I thought maybe he's doing this because he wants to be a decent or be decent for a change and help Raquel's mother. Only when I visited her, I found out that she was up for her ears in medical bills. Her husband has been working double overtime to get by. It's not what you think, Nancy. What did you do with all the money? I swear, I was saving it up and I was going to surprise Chrisette and pay it all off. I know that she and I are in a relationship, but she's the mother of our child and I didn't want her to suffer. I don't believe a word you're saying. 
The money's in my apartment. It's under a few clothes in my wardrobe. I already took care of Chrisette medical bills and then some. I honestly feel sorry for her. She married this amazing man, has a beautiful son and daughter, and yet somehow, she somehow still has to deal with your crap. Nancy, I swear the money's in my apartment. Then I'll take that money as a reimbursement. I'll have a collection agency send for the rest of my 200000 from your first stunt. You're fired. You can't fire me. I discovered Groove 5. You really should read the fine print of your contract. I'm well within my right to fire you. Dinesh will take your place. I'm glad I hired him. I knew he would find something shady about you and report it back to me. What? Yeah, Dinesh acted like he had your back, but like all of us, he couldn't stand you. I know he'll do well as the new manager of Crew 5. <laughs> Beat him up a little more, but make sure to clean up the blood. Put him in the hospital, but not the ICU. Keep him alive for a quail. Ah, uh, woo, she don't play, y'all. Don't try cross this. Don't try cross this. Be here, eh. Be here, eh. Okay. I don't uh. feel bad for him. He put himself in that situation. He already know what it is. He already know what it is. Yeah, it, it, yeah. I'm like, what now? I'm just so cute, you guys. Like, just look at my face when I turn around. I mean, just look. It's been a little over a month since we've returned from Los Angeles. Oh my God, we're just so cute. Both groups have essentially gone their separate ways for now. Uh, group five is focusing on group five and we're focusing on Mystic Storm. Today, we're having an interview and performance on Wake Up America. Let's see, what, what kind of her, what kind of her, what kind of, that's cute, that's cool. Mm -hmm. oh, mm -hmm. Should we do the loose braid? Let's do the loose braid, that's really cute. Should I change my lipstick? I don't know, I don't know you guys, no. That's cute. Does that really go with I'm having? Maybe, no, no, let's, you know what, let's go with this. Let's get, let's get, let's get, let's get, regardless of what I'm wearing, it's still cute. You know what I'm saying? Like that deep purple, 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 presents, wake up America. Hey, how you doing? They cute, okay, hey. Welcome back to Wake Up America. Today kicks off our holiday concert series. Our next guests have been taking the music industry by storm. That's right, Tina. <laughs> Tina. Last month, they took a trip to California where they had a mini tour and shot their highly anticipated music video with Groove 5. From strange love to warning signs, these chart-topping divas are becoming household names. Please welcome Susie, Nadia, Sabrina, Nichelle, and Mystic, better known as Mystic Stone. <laughs> Thank you for being here, ladies. Thank you for having us. The five of you must be exhausted. On top of filming the music video and doing four concerts, rumor has it that you finished recording your album while you were in Los Angeles. Is that true? Sure is. We have a few singles out, but it was important to all of us that we complete our album before the year is over. What was it like being in California? It was amazing. I've never been there before and to see many cities in a short amount of time was incredible. What was your favorite part of being out there, Mystic? We're gonna say meeting the fans because that uh, that was the highlight. You know what I'm saying? We wouldn't be here if it wasn't for them. You know what I'm saying? Meeting the fans for sure. For our last concert in San Francisco, we had the chance to do a meet and greet. It was so cool meeting different people and it was a great feeling to thank them in person. You're also busy, so do you have any time for romance? I have a boyfriend that I've been with since I was 20. Our schedules are so crowded that it can be hard, but we make it work. We've heard rumors of you being linked to Jake from Group 5, Nichelle. I'm sure he understands the hectic schedule since he's in the industry. Let me just say, I am a Jachelle shipper. <laughs> I know what you're trying to do, Tina. Jake and I are just really good friends. Everything has happened so fast for you all. Auditions were announced in May. The group was formed by early June, and here we are in November. It's funny you say that. I've been giving the okay to announce that our debut album will be named Fast Track. It's a title of one of the songs, but also symbolizes how fast everything has happened for us. I can name quite a few girl groups that released only one album and we never heard from them again. What makes things different from Mystic Storm? 
We all share the same love and passion for music. No one has an ego, and we know that to be successful as a group, we have to work as a team. I think that's our best quality. I agree. All right, we're out of time, but don't go anywhere. Right after the break, Mystic Storm will perform their single hit, Strange Love. Yes, Strange Love. (laughs) I'm still trying to wrap my head around all of this. Donish was a spy for you? Essentially. He had to act like an asshole the first time you met, so he could so he could gain a, tr- a Stefan's trust. He's generally nice and, and will be professional, unlike his predecessor. I can't believe Stefan's actually fired. Believe it. I can breathe a little bit easier knowing that he isn't roaming these halls, given the gossip to Jesse J. Anyways, the girls did a good job on Wake Up America. What's wrong? Yeah, they hit their attention really well. What tension? Ever since they got back from Vegas, things have been cold between them. If I don't fix things, they're going to be split up by this time next year, if not earlier. I can help. You can. I found something out. Something out. Something about Las Vegas. And it could change everything. I'm listening. Oh, what well she done found? Nancy done find out everything, don't she? I mean, she needs to be a bestie, like on my team. Like, hold up. Let me call Nancy. Hold up, Nancy. Boo. Hey. <laughs> Hey, Mystic. Hi. Can you come have a chat with us? Uh, sure. Thanks. Oh, Lord. What's the chat gonna be, y'all? What's this chat gonna be about, honey? Lord. Hey. Lord, Jace. What's up? What's going on? You deserve an apology for what happened in Las Vegas. Hmm. Go on. Mm hmm. All of us are truly sorry for leaving you by yourself at the club. You could have been hurt or worse, and we know better than to leave someone behind. It wasn't right, and you have every reason to be upset with us. We should have fought harder to go back and get you. What took you so long? Vegas was two months ago. And what do you mean, fought harder? Yeah, because what are they talking about? Like, I'm confused. That night is still a blur to us. We were all drinking, and we can't remember everything, but, but what? Why does it feel like you're keeping something from me? Because we are, Mystic. Aw. (laughs) My hubby said he loved me. We didn't just up and leave you by choice. The reason why we didn't say anything sooner was because... Sorry, guys. My hubby. (laughs) He was ruining the whole recording so i stopped recording real quick so i can talk to him and be like boy i'm recording okay don't be bothering me i am reading beyond the stage all right (laughs) anyway the reason why we didn't say anything sooner was because we didn't know how to say it which is cowardly we know but everything happened so fast you guys aren't making any sense Uh uh-oh who calling who calling hello hello hey donna oh donna's calling Hey, we're together. Hey, we're together. Wow, I'm almost. <laughs> yeah, we're together. All right, we'll be there. Uh oh, she's summoning us. Donna wants us to meet up at you and me in an hour. She said it's urgent. Oh lord. Oh lord. What we done did? Oh no. She's uh trying to figure out what the hell happened in Vegas. I guess is that my brother? It was a beautiful service, Matthew. Miranda would have been proud. Oh, his mom died. Thank you. I just wish that more of her relatives showed up. You can't beat yourself up for that, son. I know that, and I don't keep in touch with them often, but she died. You think they would come and pay their respects? That is sad. Thank you for both or thank you both for showing up. Sarah, I know you hated her, but it means a lot to me. Let's not talk about my feelings right now. How are you feeling? Numb. Part of me resents her for manipulating me and i'll feel better i'll take it one day at a time why don't you come back to jersey for a couple days you need to be around family your father's right take a few days off from work and come with stay with us thanks but i can't leave the firm right now we're trying to get everything finalized with you and me partnership before christmas speaking of which mystic saw me on set for now or never she did i knew that mystic storm and group five would be filming and i initially initially (laughs) decline the invite the invite oh my god but as a ceo it wouldn't be the it wouldn't be a good look if it wasn't there mystic didn't mention anything about seeing you she definitely saw me 
hmm I'm not sure if it's good or bad thing that she didn't tell us I don't know why I said it like it was a question <laughs> but whatever who did look like Stefan from the back I think it is where he going I know that's not his house <laughs> auntie okay that ain't his house who house that is stop it stormy oh snap what are you doing here what are you doing here and what happened to your face it was nothing now answer my question i was visiting my brother and his family wait hold up who's at the door whoa are you all right Stefan? i'm fine so you mean to tell me that the two of you are brothers yes Stefan is Raquel's biological father. Oh, that's her step daddy. So he's over here visiting his daughter. Okay, I got it. Stefan. Okay. Stefan is Raquel's biological father. No way. You told me that Raquel's father is a piece of. Nah, he is. Never mind. I'm needing back at the studio. Bye, Uncle George. See you later, sweetheart. Talk to you tomorrow. All right, bro. Drive safely. Wow, that's crazy. He didn't even know that. Can I come in? Sure. Oh, aren't they cute? Episode. Okay, episode. Get it together with the children. Okay, we need to be able to uh, have little children in here, little babies in here. I've been waiting for the longest. You know how long I've been reading episode, episode, get it together. Anyway, <laughs> Stefan. Hi, dad. Hey, sweetheart. Are you okay? You were gone for a long time. I know, and I'm sorry. I'm doing much better. Thanks. What's going on? Can we talk for a minute? Sweetie, take your brother and go to your room for a little while. Okay. Aw, aren't they just like the cutest? Look at that. We have to make adults into kids, y'all. Episode, get it together. Get it together. We waiting. <laughs> Where have you been? You've missed your last four weekends. Raquel was so worried about you. She was looking forward to spending time with you, only for you to not show up. Stop. You know what, Stormy? <laughs> they don't want to talk to you right now, Stormy. Okay, you stop it. <laughs> Sorry, my dog. She wants to, she wants to play. <laughs> I can explain. I had to get in touch with Nancy, and she told me that you were on a business trip. Then she told me that she fired you. You couldn't give us a heads up about it? Listen, I, in case you haven't noticed, this has been an incredibly stressful time for us. Having to deal with your random disappearances isn't making this any easier. I'm sorry. How's everything going with your treatment? I find out the results of the chemo in two weeks. Oh, Nancy told me everything, and, and I'm very disappointed with you. What did she tell you? You borrowed money from loan sharks, went behind Nancy's back, and leaked gossip to trashy media outlets? She even told me that one night she found you half naked and beat up in the middle of the city. You can't make these dumb decisions anymore. You're a father. Did you think about the dangers you could have put Raquel in? I made sure someone was looking after Raquel so she wouldn't get hurt. And what about now? Clearly you've been beat up again. We refuse to let your reckless decisions threaten the safety of our children. We're filing for sole custody of Raquel. <gasps> what? After everything I've done for you, this is how you thank me? Your actions are exactly the reason why we're doing this. If you know what's best for our daughter, you won't fight this. She's my daughter. No, Stefan, she's our daughter. All three of us are her parents. You need to focus on yourself and heal. Oh, that's rich coming from you. You're not even fully healed yourself. Oh my God, that was rude as fuck. See, he deserves to get his ass whooped. He should have put hands on him after that. That was rude, Stefan. Mm -mm. Don't you dare speak to my wife like that. Raquel deserves stability and safety. Adam and I can and will provide that for her. Raquel is 13. She can decide for herself. I've been a good father to her. When you want to be, you will not do this to me. Don't you raise your voice at me. Oh my God, you guys. I'm like, this... <sighs> This is sad. I'm okay. You need to leave now. You'll be hearing from our lawyer. I won't let you get away with taking my daughter from me. I will fight the both of you. Oh my God, Andrea. You made an intense scene. Oh my God, Andrea. Yes. That was 
was intense, you guys. Oh my god, Stefan is rude. Did y'all? Anyway, I'm not stupid. Uh oh, I've noticed that there's been tension between the five of you over these last several weeks. Okay, honey, and since none of you would tell me, I took matters into my own hands. All right, shit. So let me tell you what I found out. At first, I was furious when I found out the four of you left Mystic by herself in Vegas. It was dangerous, and we're lucky that she got back home safely. But I also know you, and I didn't. it didn't seem like something you'd do. Nancy and I did some digging and found this. What you find, girl? What you find? Mm, what you done found? Look at them, they partying. Dun, dun, bum, 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 bum. What, what, what's happening? Why they separate them? And where am I? What was that? I don't know how much you remember from that night, but there was a threat made in your VIP area. Security came and rushed the four of you out. I remember that. They put us in a ride chair, but we told them that Mystic was still inside. Right. They told us that since she was in another area, they arranged for someone to esca escort her back to the hotel safely. But when she never came home that night, we got worried. Exactly. So what was the threat? There wasn't any. It was all some elaborate scheme. I don't follow. Someone paid the security guards off to separate the five of you. It wasn't a plot directly aimed at Mystic, but they wanted one of you by yourself in order to catch you off guard. They tipped the typical falling out of a club, out of control drunk celebrity video. Do you know who was behind it? Her name rhymes with Macy May, of course, Jessie J. How did Jessie even know we were out there in Vegas? Apparently someone from the hotel leaked it to her. Ugh. Can't trust nobody. So now we can't even go partying without being targeted. We're looking into finding out the identities of the security guards and we'll have them taken care of. My best advice is that if any of you go partying, you need to stick together. Mystic, I know you only left to get more drinks, but it goes to show that so much can happen in a few seconds. At least go in, pair, in pairs. <laughs> pairs. <laughs> Sorry. That goes for getting done. <laughs> <laughs> that goes for getting drinks, going to the bathroom, etc. There's standard girl code. Yeah, like you don't go nowhere without somebody with you. I mean, when girls go to the bathroom, we go in pairs. Okay, honey, that's what I do at least. I don't go nowhere by myself. I'm sorry. Wait a minute. You guys told me that you left me behind because I wanted to stay with Carnell. So was that true? Kind of. You said you were going to go get drinks with him, and that's when all of this happened. It was like we had the th hit this thousand-piece puzzle, and we were missing half of the pieces. Regardless, we were still wrong. But you know what? That makes me feel better. I'm not. I'm still a little hurt, but you know, but that makes me feel better knowing that they didn't just completely leave me. You know what I'm saying? I'm glad to know that you all didn't willingly leave me. We would never do that to you, Mystic. Okay, so we good, y'all. We good. I know that this won't magically fix the tension within the group, but maybe my suggestion will help. You need to stop living together. I mean, yes, I agree. What? I know you enjoy living in the luxurious apartment, but you all spend too much time with each other. You work together, you tour together, and then you live in the same place. It's making me feel annoyed just talking about it. <laughs> me too. Ooh, it makes me itch. <laughs> When's the last time you saw or spoke with your other friends? She has a point. I do think we should have our own apartments. I agree. If you're smart, smart, if you're smart with your money, you should be able to afford a decent one bedroom outside of the city or a studio in the city. Trust me, you'll see each other all the time, but some space is necessary. We did kind of move fast with that, huh? We did. If this helps the group, then I'm more than willing to find my own place. Then it's settled. When is your lease up? Next month. Perfect. You'll thank me for this later. Okay, y'all. We're going to be getting our own place. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Sorry. <laughs> You're kidding. How was... Okay, he was caught with his girlfriend's sister? Oh, my God. The Gossip Queen. Oh, this is so juicy. Thank you. She is just Mrs. Gossip. <laughs> oh, there's her knees. What part of your fire don't you understand? I did everything for you. You're still on this? It's been six weeks, Crystal. Get over it. I spied at you and me. I spied on the music video set and I got arrested. Yeah, you did all that and yet you got me nothing. Leave. I'm your niece. You can't treat me like this. 
Oh, Lord. Oh, honey, don't take things so personally. Yes, you're my family, but this is just business. You're still my favorite niece. You just suck at getting gossip. Not everyone is cut out for this life. Now leave. You really hurt me, Aunt Jessie. I'll never forget this. Ooh, girl, you better watch out. I don't know, Jessie. She might have some under her sleeve, girl. Better watch out. Karma is a bit. Karma is a bit. <laughs> What's happening? What's going on? What's happening? What's going on? Okay. Ooh, are we getting my hair did? What we doing? What we doing? What we doing? Today is all about getting our promotional shots taken for fast track. It's going to be about an eight hour day where we take pictures in a variety of off, uh, outfits and finish up with an album cover. Oh, we're doing an album cover. Yes. Let's get started on you, Mystic. Oh my God. What are, what are we going to do? Like, I, I want my hair to look cute, y'all. Um, No, 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 maybe maybe no no maybe no hmm should i do the little pom poms or should i do the classy bun we're gonna do the classy bun because that's really cute and then i wish i knew what i was wearing so i can like pick the lipstick but it's cool we can just go regular with that voila girl you didn't do nothing i did it <laughs> thank you but we're gonna pretend she did it Oh my gosh, look how cute we are, all in white. If you want to take screenshots of your group, now is the time. Be sure to tag me on Instagram at Andrea L. Hey, Andrea girl! <laughs> are we cute? Like, hold on, you know, I had to take a picture, okay? Yes. Nope, on to the next. Oh my gosh, look how cute this is. You guys, like, I cannot, I'm taking pictures too, okay, honey? Yes, work it, girls. Yes, how cute. Uh, hey. <laughs> Are we like the cutest, you guys? Like, I cannot. I'm going to have a bunch of damn pictures. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, what's going to be the background? Because it's green. Our final shot takes place in front of a green screen, but they're going to edit in a road in the background. I'm not sure if these racetracks outfits are cute or tacky, but hey, I'm not in charge of wardrobe. <laughs> yes, fast track, honey. That one's cute. Mm, I got it. Yep, I'm finished, boo boo. I'm finished, boo boo. Uh, uh, fast track. Uh, 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 fast track. Uh, 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 fast track, fast track. Uh, Fast track, fast track. Oh, that's my brother. That's my brother. <laughs> hey, Dad. <laughs> I'm fine, but I thought about what you said earlier. You know how you invited me to come by Jersey and stay with you and Sarah for a few days? I'd like to take you up on that offer. Oh, snap. Oh, if Mystic find out, she's going to like, she's going to go crazy. She's going to go crazy. She's going to be like, what in the is he doing here? Are you serious? Oh my goodness. End up episode 14. Yeah. We done with 14. Next is 15. Okay, so I might publish 15 real quick. Like, I'm try I love this story, y'all. Y'all already know. I know y'all love this story. So, and the next one is a beyond the stage holiday special. You know we gotta read the holiday special. Like, I'm excited. Like, you guys don't understand in season two. Like, I'm waiting, Andrea. You like you already know, Andrea. Like, you already know. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh thank you guys so much for watching make sure you like comment subscribe share if you care let me know if you like it because hey i won't know unless y'all tell me you know what i'm saying especially if y'all want me to read certain stories let me know i'll go ahead and read them see how we like them yes no maybe so we'll get to it <laughs> all right guys talk to you later Bye.